Welcome back to Let's Play Heroes Chronicles. I am your host, Board Gamer Girl, and we're about to start the Tunnels of Ice scenario of the Sword of Frost campaign. Tarnum must battle his way through the tunnels inside a giant glacier if he is ever going to catch up to Jilu. Tarnum and his two best captains will carry over to the next scenario, along with all their skills, spells, and experience. All heroes limited to level 30. So we have a medium sized map this time. I believe our enemies go first. We're gonna bump this one up to. Uh, Expert as well. Three of all those, or ten wooden ore. Um, I'm gonna go with the ten wooden ore. It's better early on if they don't have if I don't have a well developed town. Um, and in theory. If I have all of these mines, this would take me five days to collect, and this would only take me three. Three. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go with this. Yeah, well, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Jilu's forces disappeared into the tunnels beneath a giant glacier, so we followed. Even though these tunnels are bitter cold, this is the type of environment my Nyon troops are used to fighting in. Unfortunately, there is evidence that Kija and her barbarians have been in the area as well. I wonder which one I will discover first. I'm going to bet on the barbarians. Okay. So, let's see just how bad our town is. Yep, yep, saw that coming. Yay for marketplaces. And that's why I took the ten wooden ore. Shouldn't have bought the marketplace. Should not have bought them on the place. Alright, well. We'll give Tarn everything for right now. You should actually also give that to Tarn. Now that I'm thinking about it, since he's going to be the one who's doing a lot of our exploring. And you can continue to collect resources and such. Oh no, don't actually... Whew, that was almost a disaster. What do you want? You are looking for someone who... I mean, I appreciate the Mercury, but level 28? Yeah, that's just not gonna happen. What's in here? Herpes and almost all of your stuff. Yay. And then I'm gonna come over here apparently. Instead of going straight down the road. Not sure why I'm doing this, but we are. I visited my prisoner at Ufretin for the first time today. I have made the dwarf wait for nearly a month to weaken his resolve and soften his anger. Along with low and sporadic rations and exposure to the cold, Fretin should be ripe for interrogation. When I approached Dufretin's iron cage, I found the dwarf half-naked, bruised, and thin, but he still managed to pull himself proudly to his feet. Make it easy on yourself and answer my questions, I said. Why don't you take off that helm and show me your real face? Or are you a coward? Dufretin responded. I had hoped to wear my helm at all times. If I showed him my face, I took a chance of Dufretin recognizing me as the same Tarnum who lived and fought alongside the elves of Avli for all those years. But I figured I owed Dufretin that much at least. I took off my helm... <clears throat> and despite the black designs painted on my face, he recognized me. Tarnum Dragon Friend! That was my elven name. Yes. It can't be, Fretton said. It can, and it is, I said. 
I looked around to make sure no one was within earshot. I shuddered to think what would happen if my Nyan troops learned that I used to fight for Avli. I am Tarnum, so believe me when I say I don't wish to harm you. I beg for your help, Ufretan. Maybe I can avoid more deaths. Ufretan was quiet for a long time. I could tell by his expression that I was one of the last people he would have ever expected behind that helm. Finally, he looked up at me, his eyes burning with hatred. I have no words for you, traitor. Yeah, that went well. Pack of Medusas. We can take on a pack of Medusas. Okay. So you'll go there. I don't know, I'm gonna come hang out there. We'll head up here. We'll start combat. We will haste you, I guess. Oof. I'm not going nearly as well as I would have hoped for. Goodbye, my lovelies. Oh, that's not necessary. Gunner. Can't pass up the opportunity for all that experience. Alright. More Azure Dragons. It's clear what we need to save up our money for. Um, right, so we need a blacksmith, because we're going to need lots and lots of money if we're going to buy ourselves some Azure Dragons. <clears throat> oh, what to do with you? I'm not really sure. I'm take the gold. I'm going to take on the pack of evil eyes, although, nope, okay. It's like, maybe they'll join me and be awesome like that, but no. Clearly not. Oh, the fact that you guys all go first really sucks. That sucks a lot. 22. Wow, you still can't reach them? Really? That's... that's... that's horrible. Did not realize. How oh, crappy. Our stuff was. Alright, so we got that. Pack of harpy hands. Wait, Gunner, why am, why are you why are you going this way? I'm not sure. Hello. Oh, a pack of black dragons. That looks like fun. Except not. <clears throat> okay. City Hall, please. Thank you. Probably start taking just all the gold. Oh, hello, a town that I want really badly. Oh, Gunner, what to do with you? I guess I'll have you run back home while she comes around and does random stuff. Gonna work on keep building up our uh, Mercury. The commander of the Medusa's Zelisa approached me today with news I had hoped not to hear. Those barbarians are everywhere on these ice tunnels, Zelisa said. 
Her Medusa scouts had been exploring the tunnels, and in every direction they spotted barbarian troops. So Keja found another way in. I've been wondering where she went. Now at least I know where she is. Good work, I said. Taking the gold. I'm just gonna let them come to us. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Alright, town portal it is. Whatever. We need cash before we can get anything else. Cash in a major, major way. I need to at least have something that looks like an army that I can send out. But I really want you to get a capital. Woohoo, expert wisdom for you. Oh, more packs of black dragons. My goodness, all we're seeing are packs of black dragons. This is a little intense. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm taking it. How can I not? Okay, so here, getting ourselves a capital. Yay. And here, we'll get a town hall. Ooh, hello. I'll take that. We shall also take on lots of infernal troglodytes. Shoot them. You can get to go first. You are, aren't you? Yep, shifts in that one coming. Oh well. Hello, pack of minotaurs. I am broke. I'm super broke. If you get a major level one, <sighs> it's interesting. I don't know exactly what I want to do here. I mean, so I could just go for building up to getting Azure Dragons require a lot of money and a lot of sulfur, and so I don't know if I'll have enough to get a lot of them. So whatever, we're going to go for regular troops as well. We're also getting you a ballista. Yes, a little ballista. Alright, you're also going to continue to hang out here for the moment. Yay, sulfur. Pack of Mentars. We will take these guys on. Okay, well. Hey there, Mentar Kings. Alright, so let's slow all these guys down. Did you guys just line up all nice and pretty for me? You don't actually have... Interesting. Do I have anything that does damage to large groups? 
fireball. Why not? We'll fireball them. <clears throat> it worked, so that's exciting. And we'll just fireball them again. We're gonna take the gold. Because I think gold is more important at the moment. If you won't talk, let me use a more aggressive means of questioning, Kilka suggested. I mistakenly mentioned my frustration over my daily meetings with the friend in front of the beholder. For almost a week now, I've been pleading with my prisoner, but the dwarf refuses to speak. I'm afraid if I don't learn the location of the Sword of Frost soon, I will never have the chance to stop Julu. No torture, I said. At least, not yet. I don't understand, Kilkit said. He had a right to be confused. I have allowed torture before, but only because I wasn't part of it. I didn't know the people. I have to listen to their scream. I didn't have to listen to their screams. But with the Fretton, a bold hero who deserves better, I couldn't bring myself to allow it. And my reluctance was causing a stir among the troops. Although I have no proof, I'm certain Kilkit is at least partially behind the increasing disobedience of my army. Still, my success depends entirely on a Fretton. And he thinks I am his enemy. Yes. Yes, he does. I wonder why that is. Good enough. Good enough. That is good enough armor for you to start killing some stuff. Although, I don't really want you... What do I want you to kill? I don't know smoking on the sulfur, huh? Well, we'll start with this. Excellent. Come closer, my little friends. Oh good, come even closer, so that I can just kill you. That worked out quite well. Yeah, I didn't really do much there. But maybe you'll show me something good, Head of Magi. Ooh, 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 I want that. Look at all these border guard tents. These border guard tents are kind of annoying. Red border guard tent. Gosh. So they can already get through, but I'm going to have to find these stupid tents. Gold mine. We need to get that. We need to get that now. Hello, Cyclopses. Eek. Alright, so they have 70 health. They have 70 health. We need to make it as 140. You do 140, alright. Why did I do that? That was silly. That's not cool, man. That is not cool at all. Trusty fireball. I should have done that first place. Would have made way more sense. 
Alright. We are completely broke, so we're going to end our turn here. Gonna have some awesome armor, huh? Why are you being so laggy? Don't understand. Back we go. Look at how dead everyone is. That's fantastic. All right. Oh, lots of front troglodytes. We will take you on as well. them. Thank you. Well, let's see if we get anything good. Boots of clarity. Not really what I was looking for or hoping for. Okay. Oh, why not? Oh, check them out. So they have a stronger army and they have crystal dragons and their strongest hero is actually relatively strong. Huh? Well, they have crystal dragons, but we have azure dragons, so, you know, we should be alright, hopefully. Not that we have any azure dragons right now, but we will eventually. Okay, then. I'm not going to argue if you're going to come up right there. I'll come down here and get this first. Chapel time. Yeah, we'll call it a day. Yes, yes, run around. Okay. You want a ballista too? Take some gold. Another pack of black dragons. My goodness. You want me to be able to take on a pack of black dragons very quickly here, people. Alright, well. Sure, you'll camp out at the Azure Cave. Advanced offense. Here, you guys will run down here, and then we're good to go. Oh, my goodness. 
such slowness. I'm not really sure why you're suddenly becoming laggy, but I would appreciate it if you would stop. Alright, City Hall. And... A Labyrinth. painful watching you guys pick up all these resources. Even though you would anyway, it's just I don't want to see it. It's a little bit ridiculous. At the moment, I guess we're going to keep doing this. We're going to keep our people alive. Especially since we can just... No? No? Really? You're not going to let me just... You're not going to let me visit the well? Really? Don't worry, I can visit this well. Oh, turn him. I think at the moment it's basically just a waiting game. I mean, we could attack this stuff, but that doesn't really make sense. The question becomes, where do I want to go? Which stack of black dragons do I want to take on first? I guess we're going to go with this one. of you get the portal of summoning. Oh gosh, I need so much gold. Yeah, I think this is the right move. I just, I need the dragons to do good things for me. And this won't get me anything in terms of money, really. 75. Not really enough, as we have learned. So, you're gonna get your spell points back. <clears throat> but it's not really gonna help against the black dragons. Truthfully. It's not gonna help at all. Alright, gonna. You are gonna get a lot of this stuff. Yes, okay. I have a plan, I guess. A lot of it is just waiting. Waiting for money. My Minotaur bodyguard escorted the Queen of the Medusa's Elisa into my tent. What have you learned, Aster? My scouts have found three strongholds blocking our way. There is another danger as well. All these tunnels intersect, which will give the enemy the opportunity to sneak up behind our frontline troops, Lisa said. Great. What do you think, Trongar? I asked the mentor. Shrugging, the big bodyguard said, hit them hard enough, and those tunnels won't matter. Right. If we take the strongholds, we win the battle, I said. But to be safe, I, maybe I should keep some troops behind to guard the small area I've conquered. Yes. That would be good. Okay. Gosh, you're just not enough money. I'm just 
it's not enough money at all. Okay, that, that is a little ridiculous. Oh no, that was totally not what I wanted to do. I hit the wrong button, but it's fantastic. Alright, so I'm gonna give not a really good guitar. That's fine. Okay, so you're gonna give him that and he'll give you this. Now the interesting question becomes, do I realistically think that an Azure Dragon can take on a pack of Black Dragons? Oh god. I don't... I don't think I think that. I don't know. Oh, uh, I've got to think about this. Well, you know what, we're gonna call it a day here while I think about whether I want to attack a pack of Black Dragons. I just, I need to move. Um, so... Thanks everyone for watching. This is Board Gamer Girl saying have a great day. See ya!